Welcome back. It is now 613 on your Friday. Time now for the morning business report. The controversial Keystone Pipeline has actually sprung a leak. Oh boy. And rising prices may have eased in November. Whew, Channel 3's Jane King is live at the NASDAQ with these stories on this Friday morning. Good morning, Jane. Happy Friday. Hi, happy Friday. Roger and Nicole. Yes, so we get a new inflation number out today. It's the biggest number of the week and it's coming on Friday. It is wholesale inflation and we do expect it to show that we have seen peak inflation. Now the producer price number that we get measures what businesses pay for raw materials and labor. Often those costs do get passed on to consumers eventually. And this is the last inflation report before the Federal Reserve meeting next week. Well, the Keystone Pipeline has been shut down following a leak discovered near the Kansas-Nebraska border. The shutdown of the major oil pipeline that carries crude from Canada triggered volatility in the energy market yesterday. And stocks did close higher, breaking a five-day losing streak. Energy and computer chip companies led things up. We're pointing to a 100-point gain this morning, but a lot of it will depend on that inflation number we get at 8.30. Live from the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King. Back to you.